Let me see you put them up. Reach the skies, touch the stars up above. Cause it's one time for the underdog. One time for the What's going on guys? Now if you remember on last episode we saw that one zombie that like a squigworth and then he died and then we said we're gonna keep another one. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make preparations for that now. We'll finish this off afterwards. But I think what we're gonna do where we're gonna keep it. I think we should put it here. Although it's a bit creepy having a zombie house right next to your normal house. It's a bit like that way walking dead with that I mean um shed isn't it really but we're gonna do this guys. So we're gonna put him Hmm Well where I put him. I know where we'll put him. I've got it planned. It won't be been keeping but it'll be fun. We'll go this far and we're going to keep him and we're going to see what happens we're going to have to wait for him to come back though because I think he's vanished I can't see him anywhere so the next time a squid with a zombie comes he's going to be our prisoner or um, friend whichever way you want to look at it, call it so we're going to use this cobblestone for now and it'd be making a zombie house because zombies can be nice too well they kinda can but it's a thing and we're doing it that's what we're doing <gasps> Whoop. Right, we'll put that there now I'm trying to figure out how to do it without him burning so I'm thinking if we just have these two here and we can see in but he can't get out kind of thing and it should be nice and dark for him all we have to do is get him to chase us into here and we should be good guys we should be but yes I want to be different on this I, w I want to do things a little bit different so I want a little zombie pet everyone has a pet dog and they have a pet pig but we're having a zombie pet and sometimes we'll take him on adventures with us and like um, it's going to be like the character Michonne unfortunately we can't chop his arms off and take his throat out and put him on um, choker chains well that'd be even easier because we'll just take him everywhere then guys and he'd be able to protect us from zombies but I don't think we have the ability to do that so we're going to do it this way instead and I think it'd be quite good but we'll have to remember when we do take him out with us when we're slapping zombies not to hurt him and to make sure he's always back in on the night then he doesn't burn right we're gonna just do it like that no that one yep that's it because it should be quite dark in there for him <coughs> <laughs> I really like this idea. I think it's quite good. We need to finish that off as well, guys. So what we'll do is we'll do this, and then we'll finish that one off while we're waiting for the night to come. And when the night comes, we shall get him to chase us in there, guys, and shut the door on him. Oh, we're going to have to make an iron door as well. Because otherwise, he'll just bash the door down. I've just fought him. So we need to go make an iron door as well. And I might make a bit down as well. And make it, yeah. And make him a little airy where he can go down. And he should really enjoy that, guys. Right then. We need an iron door and a shovel and some buttons. We don't want a platform. A platform would be a very bad idea because, uh, yeah, he'd just walk on it and come out and just maul us. I want to be his friend and not his enemy so we need that and then we need buttons where would buttons be on this update hmm well, ah that's why right now there's got to be buttons somewhere buttons I can't find anything on this guys there we go 
we've got the starts of a zombie house. Well, it's more like a holding cell, but we'll be nice to them. Right, we need to dig it down a bit. Let's dig it down somewhat for him. We'll put a torch in for us so we can see. But we will take that out otherwise it'll burn him guys and he'll he'll die. And then we're gonna need to name him. So You're gonna need your thinking caps on guys and the one that comes up with the best name. That's what we're calling guys. But I think it will be a first. Having a pet zombie. Like I said, they are pigs and they are sheep and stuff. No, we've got to be different, guys. It's got to be done. So we're going to do that like that. Right. We're going to put some stairs there. But we're going to... Build out here. It's getting dark already, guys. We're going to have to be quick. It gets dark quick on these. Right. What the flippity flop? That's no good. Right, that's better. Right, we need that, and that, and that, and there. Oh, it's just a rain. But I'm going to see if I can make a crafting table and put it there, guys. Save on time. Right, we'll swap that out for bones, put that there. There we go. Right, I'm walking away from it. You silly fool. We need steps, guys. We need four of them. Just to be safe. So we need one there and one there so I just thought if he goes further down he might feel more comfortable he might do and then we can extend it underground for him guys yeah oh I'm liking this right we're gonna extend it underground for him as well it's gonna be a proper little home for him with all the creature comforts um, a zombie should need which I have no idea what that is but we'll try to keep him happy. We'll, uh, we might even have to keep putting sacrifices in for him, guys. It could get very dark and gruesome very quick. But we'll see how we go. Right. I didn't want to do that. Oh well. I have now. Right. Get some of this out. And we'll put that here. Yeah, that's looking good. <laughs> right, then we need to build this out here. And when we want to come and say hello to him, we'll have to be very, very careful, guys, that he doesn't take a chunk out of us. Because he could possibly do that with being a zombie and all. Right. Oh, boy. No. We're running out of time. Get away, spider. I'm busy. I'm trying to build things. Don't be a pest. Be patient. Right, we need more cobblestone. We need that dog putting on when we get back down there. Oh, we're going to get attacked and attack quick, guys. We need another spade. So let's get all these things sorted out before we go back out and we're organised we've got a spade, we've got a cobblestone we've got a iron door, we've got us buttons guys we're good to go right, all we need to do now is avoid all the zombies, all the spiders, all the creepers and the endermen and quite easily sneak down here and Scotty didn't put his fin on no don't do it you sneaky little fin away with you, I'm trying to build a zombie house how dare you right we need a button don't we We've only got one button. We need more buttons, guys. Why did we only get one button? That makes no sense. It doesn't. Right. Buttons. We've got two buttons. We're getting there. We'll put button there. Put the door there. Yes. Button there. Yes. Got well that dramatic thing just ended quick, didn't it? We've <clears throat> we're gonna have to be quite crafty how we get out of there. We forgot the um, pickaxe. Yeah, 
that dramatic thing never happened right here we go let's do the button a zombie house hey <laughs> and whatever we're gonna name whatever name is the winner we'll put on the outside of the house guys for him hey <laughs> it's quite good this having a zombie we've got to catch him first though guys I don't know how easy that's gonna be I'm not quite sure but I want him to feel comfortable at home we'll put a bed in for him why not what we're gonna do as well is we're gonna kick this out so it's all stone then it looks the part guys and it looks like a cell because you won't really keep a zombie in your house you'd have to be practical about it yeah of course you would you'd have to be practical right I can hear skellies and they're not up top so I'm hoping I've not just delved into something here I'm up right we're going to put that there I want it to look practical but yet a bit like it's damp so that would look quite good uh, let me put a torch up so you guys can see not so much for we'll have to take him out though obviously or oh, the poor lad will will uh, burn like it crisp Laura's dreaming and asleep she's chasing the lad, getting something right Let's get these. Need that one there. Yeah, because that kind of looks like damp. Right, let's get rid of these torches, guys, because otherwise he's gonna. He's not. So he's got to. He's not gonna be very happy if we've got these torches here, is he? Cause it, He's gonna like it dark, isn't he? Right, so we need to get rid of that one. Oh, that's creepy. Right. I, th I think we should put him a bed, and I think it's only fair, guys. He needs a bed. We need to go get some wool. I think I've got enough. I think I have. We will soon find out. We could do a pine dot. Is that a creep in my house? Oh! <gasps> What you doing? In my house, you cheeky sod. Why are you spawning in here? <gasps> no! <gasps> really? No, that's not good. Repairs needed, guys. <laughs> They're gonna jump me. Not good. Not good at all. Look at what he did to me kitchen. That's not nice. Oh, I'm not happy with him. I am not his friend. And after we were doing this for one of his fellow zombies, he decided to do this to us. How dare he? Right, that's that. He's even blown floor up in bedroom so we can't actually I bet we can't <gasps> look at it how dare he <laughs> never mind <laughs> it could be worse there could be more <laughs> I can't believe he did that right repairs to the house before we get the zombie into the um, into his house guys I can't believe he did that. The cheek of it, just stood in my kitchen and then persisted to blow the thing up. Not very nice. Oh, we need, um, we need some doors, guys. We'll put these iron doors in here for now. Make two more doors, seeing as how he blew the other ones off. Right, I don't know if they're the right doors, but they'll do for now, guys. I can't believe that. Thank you. We're going to put glass in later on. <laughs> it's uh, kind of back to normal. A cruel, horrible thing. Creepers. Gotta love them. 
actually we'll put glass in before we forget horrible horrible swine right, let's get some glass I think it's in this one yeah it is hey dear never mind these are all parts of Minecraft <laughs> I was so positive as well with that zombie house right we have now got to hunt for the squid with zombie Uh, the squamby. Right, let's try find one. Do not blow my house up again, or I will not be happy. I quite like that. It's good. Did I put glass away? I need a glass for there. Are oh, you going to punch me right in the face? <clears throat> right. This is a creeper. All creepers must die now. Until we get obsidian, and we're going to make one of them a pet as well. We're going to have like a zoo, guys. Of all the mobs, I think. Later on. When we're, as world's a bit more established and we've got more things connected. There's a skeleton. Oh, I found one. I found one. I found one, guys. And he looks a bit like Frankenstein with his outfit. We just need to get rid of him first. Get out of me. Oh, my God. Don't kill me. <laughs> it killed me. We need to go get his stuff. It's all going wrong this episode, guys. It's all kicking off. If it takes me a year, I'll get there. Right, quick. We're going to collect all its things and fast. Because he's coming for me again. Go away. Go away, you little sod. You're causing all this trouble. Well, I'm just trying to be friends with you. Right, where did the squid with zombie go? A squamby. Where's squamby? Squamby's there, look. We found him. Have I got my map? Oh, I've got my map. Oh, I'm a bit nervous about that, guys. I didn't think we were going to get his map back. But we did. No, don't, don't burn, Squamby. Come on, quick. Come on, Squamby. Over here. Don't die, don't die, don't die. No! Right, I'm going to kill that creeper now because it's always fault before I end the episode. No, don't be cruel, Scotty. Right, on the next episode, guys, we will put him in there. We will. It's just unfortunate that the creeper will house up and we have that seater. Unless there's one up here. Can we be fortunate? I don't think we're going to be. No, we're not. That's no good. Right. But I quite like his zombie's house. It's nice. We'll put him a bed in there. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Where is uh, first death by a zombie baby? We've built a zombie house for zombie pets when we find them and it's all going and progressing guys it is and it's always fun guys and it's always a great that you're on foot ride as well guys so as always thank you very much for watching ta -da, and I'll